This is Rose, uh, a patient who presents with Parkinson's disease. She has been seen by three or four neurologists, right? Mm -hmm, yes. And uh, you've been examined by John Hopkins University. Yes. And they've all diagnosed you with Parkinson's That's disease. Uh, tell the audience some of the symptoms you've had. I have freezing when I'm walking. Um, I have when a medication isn't working. Um, there's I just can't walk across the room by myself. I have to hold on to things. Um, I'm very weak and get fatigued. Um, I have um, slow speech with um, just motor fine motor movement problems. Not able to um, wash my hair or brush my teeth or anything like that when the medication's not working. Um, little very small um, writing uh, where it's ine ineligible, it's not, um, not able to be read. Um, teary eyes, um, not able to speak, um, my cognitive level, it's my, I'm not able to um, um, actually function or um, focus on anything. Rigidity, my back is very um, rigid and, and sore, I got a lot of low back pain. Um, contractions, muscle spasms, my feet contract, I actually have my toes will crunch in and just flare out. Just a lot of spasms, muscle spasms, involuntary movement, I have some face pain too, facial pain, um, tingling in my, my shoulders. Um, How many years ago did this begin? Um, it's been about 13 years that it's all started. 13 years? 13 years ago. And uh, how, what age were you at then? Uh, about 47. 47, okay. And has it been getting worse over the past 13 years? Um, well, the medication, and at first, it just took all away my symptoms. It's, I guess it's been really, the last three years, it's been just progressively getting worse. So who, and then last year, I actually had to take off work and, and go on disability. So the medications aren't, is not as effective now. It's no, losing its effectiveness. It's, it's losing effectiveness. It doesn't, like yesterday, it didn't work at all for me. I mean, I, I was just off all day long. We are delivering the appliance now and putting in articulating paper to determine if one side is higher than the other. The patient indicates that her left side is a little bit higher than her right side. This is uh, Rose, our Parkinson patient, who's received her appliance six days ago and has been wearing it ever since the last six days. And I am reviewing her symptoms that she came in with, and uh, we'll go over them one by one. Her, she'll tell you about her, her ability to walk, whether or not that's improved. Why don't you? Um. That has improved a little. I don't feel like I'm as off balance as I was before. Okay, that's an improvement in her balance. And she was saying her, her toes would claw up. My toes would claw up, and that, that, that is, is less than that. It's less. Usually I would have that every day, and now I think it's, I've had like a couple times since I've had the appliance in my mouth. Okay, she was constantly constipated. And tell them what happened there. Yeah, I was constipated awfully. Um, and. I know since I got the appliance, I've been going regularly every day now, which was never, never for me. And what did you go before? Every three days, four days? I go sometimes every every six days. Well, and I have to give myself an enema to, to actually, you know, to be able to go. Well, that's a big improvement. That's a very big improvement. I was shocked. Okay. And you uh, had the loss of motor skills and your right arm and constant contraction of your left arm, and that's improved somewhat. That's improved yeah. somewhat, yeah. Okay. And your uh, anxiety attacks that you used to have, how frequently um, did you used to have them? I used to have them once in a while. But I wouldn't frequently have them a lot. I would have them like maybe a couple times a month. But, oh. but I haven't had, I haven't felt depressed or anything this week. No depression, okay. Weird dreams, so you used to have weird dreams? Still have some dreams, but they're not as, not as um, horrible as they were before. They've been nice dreams, actually. And depression? Um, I don't feel like I've been depressed all week. Well, those are pretty good improvements for just six days into treatment. Yeah, really. 
Uh, what we're doing today is modifying her appliance to compensate for any wear that she's had in the six days and we're increasing its height to take additional pressure off the base of her skull and uh, we're going to uh, her appliance is in the laboratory right now hardening up in a pressure cooker and I'm going to go back and uh, retrieve it and fit it to her mouth and polish it up and uh, discharge her for the day and that's going to be her entire appointment. Rose returns after wearing her appliance for 13 days uh, she's been wearing it constantly and uh, has been experiencing good results. She reports that her constipation has disappeared and has uh, gone from a, a bowel movement every six days to uh, becoming regular, at least daily or at the most every other day. Uh, her concentration is better. Her dreams have gone from weird to at least uh, pleasant dreams. Her um, experiences with her body getting very hot have gotten better. Chronic fatigue is better. She gets more done during the day. Her depression is better. Her anxiety attacks are less frequent in spite of much stress at home. Uh, why don't you comment to the viewing audience uh, how the past 13 days have been? Well, I've gradually gotten better before before I had the appliance in. Um, I certainly, my medication that I take for the Parkinson's was not working. Um, it was I had more off time than on time, um, which left me rigid and a lot of back pain. And um, that still had a little bit, I, I get that with the, with the uh, medication, but not near as often. Um, my balance is a little better. I, I have more on time with medication, meaning I, I don't have all that the symptoms of Parkinson's that I did before. Um, depression's gotten much better. Um, and like the doctor said, I just might, before my constipation was off, I, I would have to give myself an enema to, to, to go. Now it's just like, it's changed. It's like more, you know, just better, more frequent, and, which makes me feel better. Um, and all that, I'm just feeling a, a lot better. You know, my fatigue's much, I have more energy during the day. I'm able to do things like before, I, I couldn't go to the store without being afraid that my medication would stop working and I'd be in the middle of a grocery store and just like be frigid and, you know, a lot of freezing and um, I don't have that fear anymore because I'm, I'm feeling better. So, uh, it's, it's amazing. That's a good first report and I'm pleased with the patient's progress. Uh, we are modifying her appliance today uh, increasing the uh, vertical dimension of it and uh, we'll show you that as soon as it comes back from the laboratory. Chop chop. Okay, you can stop. Okay, chop chop. Okay, which side's high now? Chop, chop. Wait, tight. The right still high. Mm -mm. Okay. Same, yeah. They're both even? Mm -hmm. Okay, bite. bite. Okay. Okay, this is the, uh, of the appliance that we're, we are going to uh, uh, leave the patient with at the end of this appointment. And we'll see her in another week or ten days and see what the improvement has been over and above what it already has been. Okay, this patient has returned. She's been wearing her lower appliance for one month and five days. We completely rebuilt it today, and this is the end of today's appointment. Overall, that you're doing better, better, definitely better.